Hello YouTube and welcome to a brand new video. Now recently the new Final Fantasy trading card game released in the UK. It's been out in Japan for about five years. They've got tons of cards. We've just got the first set called Opus 1 and today we have this. It is a booster box. Now it's not a full booster box. I've gone halves with a friend of mine at work because these are quite, quite expensive. So we thought we'd... Uh, Split the cost and have 18 booster packs each. Now, I did open eight of the packs at work because I was giddy and I couldn't wait, but we've got all these lovely packs to open right now. So, uh, we'll dive straight in. So, with these booster packs, there is a hollow in every pack. I'll just show you the front there as well. This is what we get. Booster pack English. It does say somewhere how many you get. Or it might say on the box. I think you get... Th uh, there we go. 12 cards per pack. Anyway, and there's... Uh, Common, Rare, Hero, Legend, and Premium. Uh, this pack contains 12 cards, randomly taken from a total of 186, plus 216 Premium. This pack does not include any rule book. Might contain two identical. So, we'll open it backwards. And after watching people open their packs, I will go... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now, the fifth card, if I'm right, is always the Hollow. So... We'll go back first and we'll flip them over. Just to let you know, the consistency of these cards is very strange. They feel very plasticky, but let's jump in anyway. So, we've got Saz from Final Fantasy XIII, and he is a rare. Cool. Next we have... Ooh, Firion from... Uh, buh, 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 Dissidia Final Fantasy, the fighting game. He's pretty cool. He's a rare. Oh, yes! Ice-type Squall. He's also a rare, 6,000. He's got some pretty cool powers there as well. I'll go into those later in another video, I think. Cecil, nice. Uh, from Dissidia, also Final Fantasy IV. This is his Dissidia form, though. Very powerful. Next. Hey, we've got Red 13. Final Fantasy VII. Very cool. Hey, Tifa, another Final Fantasy VII. Also another fire type. Fire is the aggressive type in this one, like most games. We've got a uh, air type chocobo from Seven. We've got standard bard character. He's one of the backup units. Backups are how you generate uh, energy to summon forward, so are your attackers. We've got a knight. He's a common, I think. Hey, we've got Kimari from Ten. And the hollow is. Oh no, I flipped it down. We've ruined it. It's okay, don't worry. Sage common. And we've just got a hollow summoner. Let me just look at the bottom there. We'll zoom in. God damn it. Yeah, the C there, C. C. It's common, but it's a, it's a nice little hollow. So, that's pack one. Move that on to pack two. I've never done a booster opening before. Or a booster box opening. Oh, I've just, see, I'm fucking up already, guys. But anyway, don't worry. Two, three, four. Forgive me, it's my first go at doing boosters. So, you know... Send all of the dislikes you want. Don't care, I'm enjoying myself. So, first one. Woo. We've got Laguna. Now, it's not hollow, but it's a legendary. Quite rare cards, 9,000 power. That's the epitome of power in this game. Next we have... Oh, no way. Sid Highwind, Final Fantasy VII. That's a beastie version as well. There are multiple versions of each card. Um, whoa. Mustadio from Final Fantasy Tactics. Next we have Gilgamesh, he's a really powerful one. That's a different Gilgamesh to what I've already got. He's also got his Limit Break ability, or his Special Burst Break, whatever this card game calls them. Next we have Mime, cool, from Final Fantasy Tactics. Oh, found them everywhere. We've got Magus, that's a standard backup unit from 2, I think. We've got Argath from Final Fantasy Tactics. Chemist, Final Fantasy Tactics, another backup, Ice Type. A hey, Aerith, Final Fantasy Seven. This is her backup form, so not her forward attacking form. We've got Alma from Final Fantasy Tactics, and is that, oh no, we've got one more. We've got a Red Mage. That's another backup, and the Hollow for this one is a Monk. So that's a common again, but we're all right. Don't worry. Right, pack three. Here we go. Keep them backwards this time, Paul. Don't be a douche. Throw that away. Uh, one, two, three, four. Fifth card at the back. Off we go. 
Terror. Love that. Final Fantasy VI. That's a forward. Hope. Oh, uh, Hope Hestheim from Final Fantasy XIII. We've got Hades. Wow. From FF7. It's a backup version. We've got a backup version of Yuna. She will definitely be going in my Final, uh, my final Fantasy X deck. We've got a White Mage card. Backup. We've got a Ninja. Pretty cool forward is that Ninja actually. Yuffie, cost one. Wow, Yuffie cannot be blocked by a forward of cost three or more. That is actually a great card. We've got a Ranger backup. Rangers are pretty cool cards. We've got a Knight. I love the artwork on these cards. Tama from World of Final Fantasy. Cool. Companion and it's a backup. Put Tama into the break zone. Play one character card of cost X. Oh, cool. Next we have, we've got a black belt, sweet, Final Fantasy 3, and the holo is a Geomancer from Final Fantasy Tactics, again, another common holo. Sounds weird saying that, common holo. Right, next pack, oh, excuse me. Hopefully my battery lasts on this device, so I can carry on recording. One, two, three, four, five, put him to the back. Right, what have we got, come on. Valifor, nice, we've got one of the Aeons from FF10, so that's a summon, they're a little bit different to the forwards and backwards, they're like spells of this game, Lulu, another FF10, she's a backup, oh we've got Zack, if you control Aerith, Zack gains 2000 power, of course he does, all about Sephiroth, now he's rare but he's not the beastie Sephiroth what I wanted, but I will definitely take him, very happy, uh, we've got a ninja, forward, Oh, ignore that. Got in front of him everywhere. We've got Agath again. I think I've got a few swaps at the minute, so me and my friends are going to be putting all our swaps together and uh, just sharing away and trying to complete the full set. Thief. I'll also do a video showing on the progress of my full set, I think. We've got a Dark Knight from Tactics. We've got a Devout from 3. Yep. I love how many cards you get in these packs. We've got an Evoker from 3. Just literally just a standard backup. No ability is only cost 1. We've got Samurai, really cool card, very dangerous in numbers, and the Hollow is a Chemist. Hollow Chemist, right, cool. Next pack. These cards are getting very, very hard to find in the UK. They're selling out everywhere, so going halves on a box is the only way I've been able to do it. So, fifth one at the back, and we'll go for again. Here we go. Uh, Layla from three, cool. Nora from 13, side character. We've got Amadar from 13, who's also got an X burst ability. X bursts are pretty cool. Hey, we've got a uh, Ramza, common, hollow though. Hey, we've got a Moogle, X burst as well from Tactics. Cool. Again, another Ramza, but standard this time. Delita, standard Evoker, fire type. Zalbarg from Tactics. Scholar. More backup. We've got a Black Belt forward. 8,000. Jeez, that's pretty tough. And we've got Ramza. Now, that's weird, because I did count five, but... Yeah, anyway, let's carry on. I won't, I won't think about it too much. So. One, two, three, four, five. Off we go. Whoa, we've got Joseph. This is the card people are actually flipping out at, saying that he's too OP and he should be banned. Uh, we've got Hecatonche, that is um, Vanille's summon in 13. We've got another Lulu. We've got Zack again, cool. Build up a little army of Zacks. Hey, we've got another Moogle. Seeing some swaps here. We've got Squire from Tactics. Another Bard, we've got a fair few of that guy. Here we've got another Chocobo, 3,000 forward. We've got Ranger, Ranger's pretty cool cards, I've said that already. We've got a Knight. We've got Tama again from World of Final Fantasies. And the Hollow is... Whoa, what we got? We've got Heroic Onion Knight, only cost two. Light type. Haste, wow, that's got some sick abilities. Right, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Four more packs left, guys. Hope you're staying with me. We're at ten minutes into this video. 
pretty long for a, for a video, but you know. Right, one, two, three, four, five. Let's go. Oh, we've got a cloud, and it's a uh, light type cloud. He's pretty powerful. Only cost four, eight thousand pounds. Got some cool abilities. We've got Sylph. We have Duke Larg from Tactics. A Leviathan, we've got a summon. We've got a Dragoon from Tactics. Move my hands away a bit. Kit Sith, X-Burst Kit Sith, awesome. We've got another Tifa, weak Tifa. Chemist. Another Aerith backup. Alma, again. Red Mage and the Hollow. Leon, woo, Final Fantasy 2. Heroic, wow, he's pretty cool. Got some nice ones, I'm still wanting to hunt down that Sephiroth. Everyone wants Seth Sephiroth. Everyone. Right. One, two, three, four. God, these cards stick together so bad. Right, here we go. Come on. We've got, oh, jeez, Kane from four, uh, Final Fantasy IV. Powerful. Nuge from 10. He's pretty beast. Still not decided on what element to use yet in my main deck. Huge. Nuge and Huge from uh, 13. We've got Hecatonshire again. And Summon. We've got another Dark Knight. We've got a lot of Dark Knights. We've got another Chocobo. I'm building up a Chocobo army. We've got a Viking. Uh, a very weak forward, but it allows you to draw a card for pretty low cost. We've got a Monk. No abilities, just a 6,000 forward. We've got a Black Mage. Is that pretty? Only two to bring out as well. Jeez, that's pretty sweet. Here yeah, we've got a Dancer. I haven't seen that card before yet. We've got a Magus. Really good card is Magus. Used in combos. And we've got a Shiny Dragoon. Common, but still pretty. Right, two packs left, guys. Come on. Yeah, I am definitely aiming for the full set of these cards. Ishtola. I've not even moved the card back, so one, two, three, four this time because of that. She's from Final Fantasy XIV. Woo, we've got a nice Yuffie, full art card Yuffie there. Very cool. We've got a nice Kate Sith. He's got a special attack, he's got his limit break slots there as well. Brynhilde, that's Saz's summon from thirteen. We've got a Squire from Tactics. We've got another Yuffie, a very low cost Yuffie, that's pretty sick. Summoner, just a standard ice unit there. Evoker, another standard. Knight. Another Kimari, the same Kimari we've had all along. We've got Sage and the Hollow It. <gasps> yes! We've got a beasty Sephiroth. He's legendary Sephiroth, guys. Right, take a look at him, take a look. So, starting the top. So, Dark Type, 8 to bring out. He's a forward, war hero. First strike, when Sephiroth enters the field, choose one backup and break it so he can effectively destroy an opponent's backup. That is what we wanted, guys. That is the card I was after. And he's quite valuable as well. If I was to sell him on eBay, if someone's looking to buy him, he's probably talking about 25 to £30, pounds, I think. Which is goddamn amazing. Oh, I'm so happy. Sephiroth is going straight in the deck. Final booster pack, guys. To top this off, if I got Cloud right now or a Hollow Gabranth from Final Fantasy XII, that would make my day. Right, here we go. We've got... Oh, shit. Yes. Heroic Kimari. We've got an Onion Knight. The rare one. Very nice. This last booster pack is actually amazing. Tidus, what is this pack? God damn it. What? Vincent? We've got a mime. Wow, this pack has been unreal, guys. Magus, standard. Summoner, standard. I don't care. Vincent and Titus and everyone's made up for this. We've got a Titan Summon from Tactics. We've got a Black Mage from Tactics. We've got a Thief. We've got a Ifrit. Awesome. Right, here we go. What we got? Ah, common Geomancer, but you know what? I do not care. Sephiroth made up for that. I mean, just look at that backpack. We've got Kimari, Onion Knight, Tidus, 
Tidus, even. Vincent. That's a crazy pack. So, yeah, 10 booster packs. And that one, I even said earlier in it, if I got that, that would be the, the absolute game changer. That is absolutely amazing. I'm so, so happy we've got that card. And I'm definitely going to be doing more booster um, uh, um, openings, unboxings, whatever you call them. So, yeah, thanks a lot, guys, for uh, sticking around and watching that video. Please leave a like, share it around if you know any fans of the Final Fantasy card game. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. I'm always live streaming and putting up videos, or I try to put up videos in between live streams. So, yeah, thank you, guys, and I will see you soon.